What's up everyone and welcome back to Movie Race. Actress Vanessa Hudgens recently reunited with her high school musical co-star and best friend Monique Coleman 15 years after the trilogy's debut. The musical comedy directed by Kenny Ortega became a pop culture sensation after its 2006 premiere on the Disney Channel. Hudgens played Gabriella, the new girl at East High who falls for star athlete Troy Bolton, Zac Efron, as they audition for the high school's spring musical. Coleman portrayed Taylor McKessie, Gabriella's best friend and the captain of the Scholastic Decathlon team, determined to maintain the status quo. Now a decade and a half after High School Musical 3 senior year, the on-screen and off-screen friends reunited to celebrate the launch of Hudgens' new business venture. Hudgens shared nostalgic reunion photos on her Instagram account showcasing their enduring friendship. The High School Musical franchise brought immense success earning $4 billion worldwide in its initial five-year run. Despite their shared beginnings, Hudgens and Coleman pursued different paths in Hollywood. Hudgens explored mature roles in films like Spring Breakers 2012 and Gimme Shelter 2013 before returning to musicals in Grease Live 2016 and starring in Netflix's The Princess Switch franchise. Coleman embraced her Disney roots with projects like A Christmas Dance Reunion, reuniting with High School Musical co-star Corbin Blue. She also made a comeback in Disney Plus's High School Musical The Musical The Series final season. While Hudgens didn't return to East High for the series finale, she revisited the filming location last year sharing her nostalgia on Instagram. Although their on-screen reunion may not happen, their enduring friendship thanks to this iconic franchise remains evident. Their enduring friendship, nurtured through the iconic High School Musical franchise, has transcended the screen and continued to blossom over the years. Despite their diverse career paths, Vanessa Hudgens and Monique Coleman have remained constants in each other's lives, showcasing the deep bond forged during their days on the set. As the years passed, both actresses evolved professionally and personally. Hudgens' journey led her through a spectrum of roles, demonstrating her versatility as an actress, while Coleman embraced her roots and found new avenues within the Disney family. Even though their on-screen characters may not reunite, the real-life camaraderie between Hudgens and Coleman stands as a testament to the genuine friendships that can arise from shared experiences in the world of entertainment. In addition to making fans of High School Musical happy, their reunion served as a poignant reminder of the enduring influence the franchise had on a generation. Two teenage actors who were brought together by coincidence and bonded by their love of performing share a narrative that has evolved into an enduring friendship, demonstrating that some relationships are as strong as the tunes of a beloved musical. In a complex narrative twist, the original High School Musical cast featuring Corbin Blue Monique Coleman and Lucas Grabeel portrayed fictional versions of themselves while filming the reunion movie at East High. The story picks up years after the characters had graduated from East High, with Troy, Gabriella, Chad, Taylor, Sharpe, and Ryan heading off to different colleges. According to the fictional High School Musical 4 movie, college life didn't keep them apart. However, in this reunion, Troy and Gabriella faced challenges, attending couples therapy, though the series didn't delve into the specifics of their relationship status. Even though Zac Efron and Vanessa Hudgens didn't make on-screen appearances in High School Musical The Musical The Series Season 4, their characters were referenced, suggesting their presence in the fictional fourth movie. While details about Troy and Gabriella's relationship remained vague, Chad and Taylor, portrayed by Corbin Blue and Monique Coleman, were happily married. This sweet development provided fans with a satisfying moment, giving the often overlooked couple from the original films a chance to shine in the Disney Plus spin-off series. In High School Musical The Musical The Series Season 4, during the high school reunion scene, Taylor reveals a surprising career choice. She is now the principal of East High, deviating slightly from her original aspiration of becoming the President of the United States as mentioned in the third film. While this new direction for Taylor's character diverges from the canon of the original movies, it's not uncommon for young adults to change their goals as they navigate through college and adulthood. 
Her role as a principal, although unexpected, adds depth to her character's journey. One of the most significant revelations in High School Musical 4 The Reunion presented in High School Musical The Musical The Series Season 4 is the acknowledgement that Ryan is gay. While fans had speculated about his sexuality during the original films, Disney hadn't explored this storyline back then. Thankfully, the Disney Plus series, with its focus on inclusivity, embraced this aspect of Ryan's character in the plot of the fictitious High School Musical 4 movie. Additionally, the series introduced Ryan's romantic partner, portrayed by Scott Hoying in the fourth film. Although Hoying's character remains unnamed, Lucas Grabeel's character informs everyone that Ryan and his partner are expecting twins, a heartwarming detail considering Ryan and Sharpay are twins themselves. While Sharpay's fate remains undisclosed, the focus shifts to Ryan's relationship dynamics in this fictional reunion. High School Musical The Musical The Series Season 4 also showcases a duet sung by Ryan and his partner, a song titled Over Again from High School Musical 4 The Reunion. Although the episodes do not delve into Ryan's character in depth, the duet performed by Carlos and Seb provides fans with valuable insights into the couple's dynamic in the fourth High School Musical film. This inclusion highlights the series' commitment to exploring diverse and authentic narratives within the beloved High School Musical universe. High School Musical, the musical the series' willingness to delve into Ryan's character and his relationship in High School Musical 4 The Reunion reflects the evolving landscape of storytelling in media, emphasizing the importance of diversity and inclusion. It provides fans with a more comprehensive view of the characters they grew up with, showing that life beyond high school has its own set of challenges and experiences, including identity and relationships. As fans watched the reunion and fictitious plotlines unfold, they had the opportunity to connect with beloved characters from their past while appreciating the show's commitment to progressing with the times. The inclusion of LGBTQ relationships and the exploration of Ryan's identity serve as a nod to the changing attitudes and societal norms that have become more visible and accepted since the original High School Musical films were released. The High School Reunion episode, with all its intriguing character developments and surprises, keeps the spirit of High School Musical alive while offering a contemporary twist that resonates with a new generation of viewers. As High School Musical continues to evolve in this era, it remains a cherished and iconic franchise that captures the hearts of audiences, whether through its original films or the inventive storytelling of High School Musical the Musical the Series. In the High School Reunion scene within High School Musical for the Reunion, Casey Stroh delightfully reprises her role as Martha Cox, much to the excitement of fans. She joins Chad, Taylor, and Ryan as they come together to kick off their 15-year High School Reunion and pay a special tribute to the unforgettable Miss Darbus. It's a heartwarming moment, showcasing the enduring spirit of the characters. As the plot of High School Musical for The Reunion unfolds, Corbin Blue, who plays Chad, provides some intriguing details. He reveals that Martha has evolved into a world-class choreographer, a fitting and well-deserved path for her character's journey. This revelation adds depth to Martha's character, highlighting her growth and success since her days at East High. The primary storyline of High School Musical for the Reunion, as shared by Corbin Blue in High School Musical The Musical the Series Season 4, revolves around the retirement of Miss Darbus, portrayed by Allison Reed. This central plot thread continues throughout the season, with Miss Darbus featuring prominently in multiple scenes, often interacting with Gina and Max's characters. Her impending retirement is a pivotal theme, and it culminates in a heartfelt monologue about her decision. However, in an unexpected turn of events, however, in an unexpected turn of events, as Bart Johnson's character reveals in Episode 6, Gina's character, Bailey, persuades Miss Darbus not to retire at the end of the fourth High School Musical film. This twist injects a new layer of complexity into the storyline, showcasing the enduring influence and connections between the characters, even as they confront the changes and choices that life brings. And that's that for today's video, folks. We hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more amazing content.
Also, don't forget to comment below and let us know which things impressed you the most. And your suggestions for the future videos are always welcome in the comments below. Thanks for watching and we will see you in the next one.